morning good morning so i'm just going down to finish up my chores i had my lunch and all these chickens and turkeys want something to eat so i'm just out here today is not freezing cold and i'm super thankful for it i've only had to ice out or chisel out the ice out of the waters one time today so far, I don't have any cows that are in the wrong fencing. So today is a great day on the farm. So I just thought I would say hello. There's not much happening. We're still two and a half weeks away from starting the house build. We'll see how that happens. So, and we have been um, freezing, absolutely freezing cold. Negative 15 was um, one of the nights. So it's been really cold. All of our pipes are still frozen and we are just trying to make it through the winter. So I just thought I would pop on here and say hello and um, I'll talk to you later. See ya. white ones are the ro royal palms. The gray one's a blue slate. They are so much fun to have. They, they just love us. They're so fun. We have five Wagyu cows. A little bit different faces on some of them. This number two here is the most friendly one out of all of them. Feels much better today. Yesterday was absolutely freezing cold. Not didn't get out of the freezing range at all, all day and all night. And I think the night before was 15 degrees below zero. So it has been super cold, super duper cold. And that's Sienna, my longhorn. I don't think she's pregnant, so dang it. And there's B Lucky, our bunny. And we're making it in the snow. I'm glad that the snow's covered our food because now the the tarps aren't flapping around like they were. We put everything we could up on top of there to try to hold them down in the windy fall. We were struggling, struggling for a little while trying to get everything nailed down. And then we've decided to put some protein in there and they're in there licking the protein. Kind of mainly for the pregnant girls but it's fine if they share it so over here is my water this is how we're doing it off grid the struggles real and I watered them this morning and look at that already it surprises me that I've never been a farmer but um, Cows drink more water, it seems, in the winter time than they do in the summer. That's how they keep their metabolism going. So I just come down and chisel it and check it and refill it as many times as they need. So anyway, I just thought it'd be fun to just check in today and say hi. We don't have much going, but as soon as that barn dominium starts being built, I'm going to start sharing all that journey with everyone and I cannot wait to do my garden stuff so I just can't even wait to share my seed starting I got some oats and I even bought some peanuts I've never planted peanuts before but I'm gonna plant some pe uh, variety of peanuts and I will share with you what I ordered what I got how I plant it and how it goes for us. So stay tuned. So it's 
much better today. It isn't as cold. I'm enjoying it a lot better. It's a little bit stressful when it's freezing cold. It's still cold out here, but they, they look like their bellies are full and they're just relaxing. Probably if I left them alone, they'd probably just lay down here. Sure are a pretty color, aren't you? It's much better when he's clean. But he's so pretty. She is gonna have a Texas Longhorn baby. You can see her belly move sometimes. It's kind of fun. She won't let you touch her. And that is not her calf, but she's just really, really nice to him. That's his mom right over there. The not plain red one, the other one. And she's pregnant also. And Sienna is questionable if she is pregnant or not. We've seen signs the other day that maybe says that she did not take with being bred. Which makes me sad. There's always next year. But I was hoping that we'd get a calf out of her because she's such a sweetheart. Huh. She's such a sweetheart. Beautiful color too. Her too. You're such a sweetheart. All right, I'll let you guys lay down. I just thought I would check in today and on this cold day, tell you what we're up to. That way when we start doing other things, you'll get to see when we finally have some action happening around here. <laughs> Talk to you later. Bye.